Next for Tyson is we need to get him out. Whether these cowboys get the job sorted, which I don't think they're going to do. What they signed, they signed nothing in my eyes. They've got no date, no venue, no nothing. Tyson needs to fight twice this year, with or without AJ. Listen, I told you lot, what, two months ago, or that however long ago, these guys don't want the fight. They were talking about telling me some mind games. <laughs> Where are the mind games? What, John Fury is playing mind <laughs> Big John, listen, Big John don't do the mind games. And I don't even f***ing swear. Big John speaks from his heart. He wears his heart on his sleeve. He ain't doing the mind games. I just don't think the time is right for a fight of that magnitude with the state of the world at the minute. How else can you explain that? It's clearly telling you how it feels. He doesn't want the fight. They don't. They, they want a tune up. Give this guy his tune up. Announce the tune up, and let's crack on. Listen. As soon as he mentioned that inactivity stuff from the jump, I was on him. I was on him. Oh, I, oh, I was on him. No mind games. He's speaking from the heart. He has in fury, as in Tyson Fury. He wasn't joking. He was worried about that inactivity stuff. People coming in the comment section telling me, oh no, no, he's just playing mind games. Mm, nah, 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 I don't I don't think so. I don't think so. The way they're banging on us all all like entitled and stuff, like they like somebody owes them something. Listen, your team did not book your fight last year, whenever, what, December or whenever. Or even or even January, February, whenever, early this year, you could have fought too. So why are they all acting like it's um it's the other side's fault or it's it's everybody else's fault. Listen, Eddie Hearn ain't supposed to get you no know, run out. That's that's not Eddie Hearn's issue. That's not his fault. Listen, AJ's calm. He just fought in December. He's not worried. <laughs> he's not worried. He's, he's relatively active. Even though he's he, he was off a year after the, the after the Ruiz fight, he's not necessarily the most the most active boxer on the planet, but you know. At least he was out in December, so he's not really as worried as you are, but you you know, yeah, it is what it is. You just gotta sit tight, be patient, and fight when the time's right, or you know, just yeah, pull out and go go have your tune up. They're so funny the way they talk, Big John and, and Tyson. They'll give all the reasons, all the excuses why they themselves don't want the fight, and then <laughs> they'll close out with oh yeah, 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 but you know. Don't they don't want it, want it. Don't and I don't blame them. <laughs> like what? Wait, what? You just told us COVID, or oh, it's not the time. It's not the right time. This, that, and now you're saying they don't want it. No, 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 no. It sounds like you don't want it. What are you talking about? You know what's funny as well? This guy crying about a date and a venue. I swear, the first Wilder fight, the exact same thing happened where they signed um, without having a, a venue or a date. I swear the exact same thing happened. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm sure they were telling us, oh no, 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 calm down, it's on, it's on, it's on. They kept saying it's on, it's on. And then when they announced the fight, they didn't have a venue and a date. And then people were thinking, huh, what's going on? But they were telling us to calm down. I swear that's what happened, but yeah, correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> but the undisputed fight, you got such an issue with them not being able to secure a date and a location. Listen. If you want the fight, you calm down like you told us the previous time in the first while the fight. When two parties want the fight to happen, the fight happens. So do you want the fight to happen or not? Nah? It's getting kind of pathetic. All these interview after interview after interview talking about this, that and the third. Just come clean and say, hey, listen, we want to go the tune up route. And well, quite obviously, it's probably his hand decision if he if he goes ahead with the undisputed fight or not because they've poured a lot of money into this guy and not recouped as much as they would like if anything so yeah they probably want this undisputed fight to take place that's why Tyson and his dad they sing in one tune and his handlers are singing a different tune like yeah now nah, we want this fight to take place so yeah they probably they had been Tyson and his and John, they don't have much of a say. All they can do is just cry to the media, which is what they're doing. They're probably just gonna cry their way to the ring and that's pop, what it pop, is. Bang! On the floor, end of. Give me them belts back where you stole them. You bum. And that's it. As usual, leave your comments in the comment section below. Like, subscribe if you're new here, and yeah, touch up the notification bell. I'm out.